this is the food they gave me in this hotel and eventually i got one that i'm actually happy with like i'm really happy with it it's basic but it's clean and that's the most important thing i'm going to show you guys around now so when that's the door that's the door when you walk in and there are two chairs here you know i was able to get this eventually i was able to get this with the help of a friend and uh, we were actually driving from hotel room to hotel room and just checking out the rooms to choose and it's interesting if i can use the word interesting to see how people boldly have hotel rooms that are like i don't even know and toilets and bathrooms that are rotten uh, that are rotten and they still have the gods if i can use the word the gods the gods to actually show you these rooms it's crazy i was even saying to this friend i was like to them that's actually okay because for them to show you boldly confidently they don't seem to realize how bad the bathrooms are but anyway so once you walk in there are two chairs here which are basically not being used i was hungry last night and i ordered uh, i think it was uh, what did i eat about a few slices of bread and i had an egg fried egg so that was what i ate yesterday so oh shoot my leg it's already past midnight it's um it's already past midnight it's like 22 one in the morning and i dozed off earlier so i never really i dozed off earlier and now i need to eat something and i ordered this just egg and bread and it's three thousand naira i'm just making these videos um just to show people what things how much things how much things cost and stuff like that that's basically why i make it a lot of the food videos and um, so that's it 3,000 uh, 3,000 naira um, so don't mind the bed now because I just got out of it and I was trying to do some I was trying to kind of do some uploading my files online and stuff like that and some of my stuff all, all the things I need like um, the things I need handy uh, the things I need handy are the things I have here like um, moisturizer I'm not even moisturizing it's only my face I've been moisturizing because the heat is ridiculous um, so um, sunscreen sunscreen cotton board um, what else just a few things like that yeah a few things like that deodorant room spray things like that so that's the bed the bed is messed up at the moment but I'm gonna be honest it's clean you know and that's all you want a clean room I'm happy with that um, I have all my things charging over there on this side I have my my watch my watch is charging and I, char I already charged my power bank and there's a chair here and a table a desk to do whatever work you want to do and there's a fridge in here where I have my cold drinks I have more drinks that are not cold um, the thing I realize that when I'm in an AC and an air conditioned room, I'm not as thirsty. But when I'm out and I'm hot and sweaty, I'm so thirsty. Okay, so here yeah, they did my laundry yesterday. I forgot to film that. I was kicking, was kicking myself for forgetting to do that. They did all of this laundry for seven thousand naira. Anyway, there's a television. There's a mirror here. There's a mirror here. There's a television there, and uh, more of my stuff. You know, I didn't. I don't typically put my things away like that. Honestly, I don't use wardrobes like that. Now, speaking about what my biggest concern, what I hate the most, for me, hotel room, the bed should be clean and the bathroom should be nice, clean, right? Not discolored, not that. No, clean. You know, none of that. But anyways, and this bathroom is the winner since I came to Nigeria. Can you guys see it? I hope you can see it. I should have flipped the camera around. Let me see. No, okay. Can you see the bathroom? I flipped the camera around. Amazing. But it's okay. I, like, you're not asking. Like, I'm not asking for too much. It's okay. Look. It's just toilet. I uh, have it been there. You see, the floor is clean. Like, there's no... Like, you know the way some of them, the tiles, you will see, like, rotten. Let me... You know the way some of them with the walls, the camera is actually, let me try the other phone. This camera is not doing this justice. One second. No, here it is. I think this is better. Oh yeah, this, I think the, this camera is better. So yeah, this is it. Basic, there's nothing amazing, just the floor is clean. That's my face wash. I didn't bring the whole uh, bottle of it, so I took some out of it. And that's my shower gel there. This is the hotel uh, shampoo. Um, soap, shampoo, 
and moisturizer that's the water supplied one so and that's my own hand wash that i that's my own hand wash you guys know me by now that is an antibacterial hand wash antibacterial hand wash that i came with so that basically the motor i have one luggage here another one here sorry I have one luggage here, another one there. So yeah, that's it. That's my hotel room and that's me over there. Hi guys, I'm about to go out but the rain that fell, it's good because it's going to cool down the whole city. But um, I don't have the shoes for that. I have that. I came with summer shoes. I came with sandals because I came with summer sandals, you know, because it's a warm, hot country. And this one is how filthy it looks. My plan is when I go back, I just throw it straight in the washing machine. Because I've been walking a lot. Look at how dirty it is. I go home, I'm gonna throw it straight into the washing machine. So okay, that's my room tour and I think I hope I did and look at look at that. The amount of filming I have done. Oh sorry, let me move back. And look at this. This is to show you the amount of filming that I have done. I have bought a lot of Nigerian SD cards. I didn't realize how much SD card I was gonna need. I have spent a lot of money on SD cards. These are Nigerian ones. This I came with this one and this one. You can see these two. Those two, they filled up so fast. <laughs> Content creation. So I got new SD cards. You know, I came so I bought you can see I have four in here. This is two each. I have another three here. I have one in the I have one in the camera right now and then I have another one in my bag the last one that I bought you know so hopefully that's enough I don't have to buy any more these things cost me a lot of money this is another hack I forgot to show you guys that is a cutting wool for cleaning my face right I put it there and then I use that for flushing the toilet by just pressing this that way I'm not do you know what I mean I'm not pressing the button or that for that first do you know what I mean so I wanted to show that hack as well so in this one, I want to show you guys how I do this one. Uh, <laughs> I always find a way just to make sure nobody can come in when I'm in the room sleeping. So this one, you can see what I did here. I put the, this doesn't go any lower. Right? When somebody tries to pull it down, it stops here. You see that? This kind of prevents the door from going any lower than that. You can see the lock is still intact. You can see, you see, these are just minor little things for a solo traveler especially when you're female uh, it's just when you're sleeping you want to be sure you're sleeping and nobody's gonna come in and um, always find ways i know there are things they sell that i was trying to get there's this thing you can actually use for hotel rooms that can actually prevent it from opening i tried to buy it i couldn't find it to buy and then towards the end i wanted to buy it online there was not enough time for it to be delivered but i have been finding ways to help me feel safe i just wanted to keep sharing these tiny little tips with uh, you guys i actually have this one is a concentrated disinfectant i'll show you guys how i use it or i'll show you guys how i'm using it so this is my dis disposable towel i already dried my body with this one so it, i've used it already to dry my body but now i'm using it i just poured some of it here some of the disinfectant here and then i poured water on it as well and i just go like that okay and the way I'm cleaning it, there's part of the water, like, you know, it's still kind of wet. So this disinfectant is honest, giving it time to work even better. So I try to basically clean places I want to put things, places I want to, you know, places I know I'm going to be touching, like this handle now. I will touch it. And then inside... I may not even use inside to be honest with you guys. You know what? I'm gonna put everything at the top. Save me cleaning the inside. You see? You see how dirty it is. So I'm just gonna flip another side of it. Okay, the inside part of it. And I'll just wipe the light right light switches. Normally the the disinfectant spray I just spray on surfaces. Sorry guys. The blinking light, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to clean it because I'll be touching this. Now cleaning this as well because I'll be using it. Okay, that way you feel so comfortable. You feel very comfortable pressing these buttons because you know you have cleaned it. So I'm going to wipe this clean as well. I shouldn't have to be touching other people's dirt. Let me flip to another side of it. 
the side I haven't used. You can see this side is clean. So I had wipes, but I've disinfected wipes. I've used them. I've used them all up. So this is how I'm improvising. Okay. This is the... <laughs> this is earwax. Right? All I did was clean the insides of this. Right? Most honestly, most hotels don't bother cleaning this. They don't. So I wipe down all the numbers. Now I'm going to use them comfortably without any irritation. And, you know. The guy just told me it's 14,000. Rice and mala with a goosey soup. I have fish and I have um, beef. 